What have you been doing? Working. Meet Carmen Renfro Charleston and Irene Rosie, two very different women with two very different cancers. This is the breast cancer tumor right here. I discovered uh, that I had a lump doing just a basic monthly self-exam. This is Irene's. You can wear a big C on your forehead, or you can simply say, there are options. Both women made the same choice, a clinical trial for a new kind of therapy. More than 300 women took one of these estrogen-lowering drugs, hoping to shrink their tumors and avoid mastectomy. The obvious benefit of saving the breast for the patient herself is huge. Before making the next treatment decision, doctors track how each woman responds to the medication. My tumor did not grow. It didn't do too much shrinking, so I still had to have the lumpectomy. Within one month, there was a notable decrease in the tumor. It was very noticeable. In a national study, more than 50% of women with stage 2 and 3 cancers were able to avoid mastectomy by taking an estrogen-lowering drug first. The drugs are also an indicator for whether chemo will work or not. It helps doctors tailor treatments to specific patients. Carmen needed chemo. Irene didn't. Both kept their breasts. And so our goal is to find targeted therapies for each individual patient that are going to be effective for her, not for masses like her. Now Carmen and Irene are both cancer-free and loving it. You know, we're free, we're fine. Taking action for your health. I'm Linda Hurtado, ABC Action News.